Hello everybody, in this video I'm going to show you how to move a shared folder from one volume to another volume in QNAP. So as you can see, I've logged into my QNAP dashboard. The model of the QNAP that I have, let me show you. So version TS431P. Now let me show you how to move it, the shared folder. So I've got here the folder that I want to move, so I want to move the homes folder. So it's currently in the volume data volume 2. I want to be able to move that to data volume 1 underscore 1 because that has more space. So I want to free up some of the space that is in data volume 2, which will be roughly about 1 terabyte, and move it to data volume 1. That already has over a terabyte of free disk space, so there won't be any problems. So the first thing to do is you're going to edit this folder. Give it a, a new name, homes.old. Apply that. So the renaming the folder is completed. Even though it shows that there's the size is zero, I logged in, I checked the file station and there is files in there, which is good. Now what we've got to do is we've got to use a tool within QNAP. So we've got to use a tool within QNAP. And that tool is called HBS3. So if we go to the apps. And we do a search for H HPS Hybrid Backup Sync. That's the one. It needs an update. Let's update it first. So what we're going to do is we're going to do a one-way sync job so that we're copying the folders from the old share to the new one. While it's doing that, I need to also create... Okay, so now we're going to create the shared folder. So if we click on create, shared folder, put homes, which is going to be the new one. So as you can see, the size on the data volume 2 is 90 gig. And I'm going to choose data volume 1 underscore 1, which has 1.4. So that's correct. Let's specify the path automatically. So it's going to create just the homes. And just give rewrite to all the users. Next, everything looks fine. Click on finish. So now, so as you can see here, I've got homes. I did have one called homes dash three TV disk, and that already had a path to homes and that's why I the other one that I created called homes didn't show up so I just renamed this one from 3d terabyte disk so I removed the 3 terabyte disk and then applied it so that looks correct so what I've got to do is go to the HBS3 disk so let's open up that app This one here. So what we're going to do now is create a one-way sync job. So now we've got the HPS software here. So we're going to do a sync. Sync now. We're going to do a one-way sync job. 
on a synth like who Naz So local one way sync homes folder sync let's have a look at the parent folder so we're going to choose the old the old homes folder this one here and we're going to sync it to the new homes folder here so we're going to go next no schedule just sync it now and then just create it and we're just going to let it run so now it's going to copy all the files from the homes.old folder which is in a different volume to the homes folder in the new volume and that's it so you just going to let that run it's going to copy all the files and that's how you move folders from one volume to another once that's done you can go back to your homes.old folder and you can delete that but you just got to make sure that all the files have been copied across and once you've confirmed that just delete the old folder i hope this video helped if you did please give it a like and subscribe to the channel